Hi there everyone, welcome to my channel and then in this tutorial video guys, we will create a program that will solve the student final grade using Java programming language. Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all my viewers, supporters and subscribers in my channel. Thank you for watching my videos, sharing and most importantly by subscribing in my channel. Your support is highly appreciated to the growth of my channel. Without you guys, my channel would not be uh, possible and successful. I would like to shout out my avid supporters and subscribers, Sir Ernil, Mam Robilin, and Mars Malon. If you want to be shout out in my channel, kindly put your name and shout out. Sa mga kapwa ko pong Pilipino, maraming salamat po sa inyong panunood, suporta, at pagtangkilig sa channel ko. Kung bago lang kayo sa channel ko at nagustuhan nyo ang mga video ko, pakilike lang po share and pakisuyo lang po, pakisubscribe lang po malaking tulong na po ang inyong suporta sa akin no? Bi bilang kababayan nyo na appreciate ko po ang inyong tulong no? sa panonood no? at sa kapagtangkilig sa sa Jake Pomperada channel maraming salamat po guys Okay, so before we start, no, uh, I would like to mention everyone that I will put a link in the video description where you can download the complete source code for free in my two websites. Majority of my subscribers uh, likes my tutorial video in Java programming language. As much as I can do, I try to uh, make uh, much um, many no, Java tutorials. No? So... Uh, most of the time, majority of my videos is more focusing on C, C++, and then lately, I have Visual Fox Pro, JavaScript, PHP, Visual Basic, .NET, C Sharp, okay? So, basically, I'm using uh, Eclipse as my IDE, no? Eclipse IDE for Java developers, no? So, some of the people will ask me what kind of IDE that I'm using. So, in my videos, I'm always telling... If, our, if I'm working with Java, normally I'm using Eclipse. Rare cases, I'm using BlueJ or sometimes NetBeans. But I can say 90% of the time, I'm using Eclipse. Okay, so we have here some comments, no? Student underscore final grade that Java, no? The file name of our program. The author, yours truly, Jake Rodriguez, Pomperada, Maid IT, MIT. And then I have two websites where you can download complete and free source code www.jackrpobrada.com and then the other one is www.jackrpobrada.blogspot.com where you can download complete source code for free no? and then currently I'm accepting computer programming jobs programming assignments in C, C++, Java, C Sharp or whatever programming language that you have no? you can send me an email no? at jackrpobrada at gmail.com quality service at a very affordable cost and then my location is Bacolod City, Negros Occidental, Philippines so the first line of code no, is uh, in Java import Java util scanner for input output the name of our class, public class student underscore final dot grade public static void main no, it is a uh, function in every prod, uh, java program that is being executed by our java compiler and then scanner input new scanner we creating an object names input no for input output no in java and then we have here series of variables double pre, uh, prelim underscore grade midterm underscore grade end term underscore grade final underscore grade no so, uh, when we say double it is a data type that has a decimal value. Now, much bigger to float. So, C, uh, car C, is, uh, C in CH form, do you want to continue? No, do. And then we have here a uh, system out of uh, print line. The title of our program, student final grade in Java. And then we have here, uh, give student prelim grade. So, prelim underscore grade input next double. Uh, gave student uh, student midterm grade midterm underscore grade and gave uh, student interim grade no next double no to so in our variable interim underscore grade 
a new line and then we have here assignment statement final underscore grade equals prelim underscore grade multiplied by 20% midterm underscore grade multiplied by 30% and then the interim grade underscore grade is 50% and then we have here the student final grade math round we don't ha want any decimal uh, decimal no value so we run it off to the uh, uh, nearest 10 and then our program I designed it uh, that will ask the user do you want to continue Y for yes and for no C input next at car at zero no so uppercase conversion yes if no, it will display thank you for using this software and then we close our scanner and then we close our class here. Don't worry guys because I will put a link in the video description so that you can download the complete source code for free. Let us run the code so that we can test now. Okay. So student final grade in Java gives student prelim grade. Let's say we have 87 midterm. 75 and term we have 98 so the student final grade will be 89 do you want to continue yes uh, student prelim grade we have 88 midterm let's see 65 and term 98 student final grade is 86 do you want to continue yes and no it will display thank you for using this software Okay guys, so this is the end of our tutorial video on student final grade in Java programming language. I hope that you have learned in this tutorial video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Leave a comment in the comment section of this video tutorial. Click the notification bell. Select also that you will be notified with my newly uploaded video. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new with my channel. Thank you so much for watching again. No? So this is your friend Jake saying see you in the next video tutorial guys. Bye bye for now.